Hello everyone, and welcome back to Endless Space with Cream Maria Bull. Um, today we're going to start fresh, uh, yeah, start a fresh new game with my, uh, custom race that I have been talking quite a bit about, I guess. And, um, it's going to, uh, be a lot better <laughs> than the first game. I do, uh, yeah say. So anyway, okay, new game here. I've got, I have my, uh, sour, sour, whatever you call it. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. Uh, race. They are based off the sour, sours, 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 I don't know. I'm gonna just call them robot, robots. It's the robot peoples. Uh, anyway, I have, let's go ahead and click modify to see what all I have here. So anyway, the, sour, the uh, affinity uh, takes 50% out of, uh, from food, 50% food away from the system, but adds 40% of our industry to our food. So. It really helps, because <laughs> we can just focus on uh, <laughs> raising our industry, and our food will go up at the same time. And then later, we'll be able to research the uh, uh, research that uh, lets you you put all your all of your surplus food into industry. So. Hopefully that doesn't bug the game out. I hope they thought of that when they made this. Yeah, so that just be really buggy. They did something crazy. But anyway, I gave them black thumbs, which takes more away from this, more food away from the system. But it really, I haven't really seen a big uh, difference with it that much gone. Right, then I have. Uh, so it's cheaper. I have a one point in builders, which allows uh, faster, uh, lower industry cost, so things get built faster. And then I have uh, crowded planets, so on small, small and tinies have two additional spots for people, and on mediums they have one additional spot. Um, then I have deadly weapons, because, yeah. So I, so I deal some extra damage on my uh, fleets. Uh, dust impaired, I haven't seen any... Well, it's probably abilities for like... Uh, uh, ship captains, fleet admirals, and whatnot. So I haven't seen any of those yet, because I haven't put any on a fleet yet for the heroes. But it'll just cost more dust, which I'll have crap tons of dust anyway. And I have uh, my starting planet will be mineral rich, which will give me three uh, industry on the planet. I have optimistic, which is really going to help us a lot, uh, which gives a plus 20 re uh, approval rating on, the system, on every system. Then we have scientists, which will give 10% uh, science on this each system. Uh, sloppy saw, Sawbones, 50% extra healing cost. I don't really care, I've never had to heal my heroes. And I have Snipers, which give me 10% uh, more accuracy on my fleet. And then Stellar, stellar Guardians. <laughs> People in uh, multiplayer games that I play against when I play this uh, race, they're like, wow dude, you're a uh, Influence is so huge, and it's like, yeah, I know. As I get four from this, and then three from the satellites. Then later on, I saw uh, there's some research that gives uh, like 10% or 20% more influence, so it just have a huge sphere of influence and no one would, will be able to get through without 
being my ally or being at war with me. So, yeah. Anyway, I see that. We will go ahead and accept that we want to play them. Now let's uh, change this up a bit. We just did the spiral. Hey, let's try out a... Yeah, we'll try it when elliptical. Do... Uh, do three empires. Uh, normal's fine for that. I like huge. Medium density is alright. Star connectivity. I'm not really worried about these things. Um, I could, if I wanted to make the most use out of uh, the crowded planets, I could grab that. But I really like big planets too, so I'm just gonna leave that at normal. Resources are normal. That's fine. And it's for system. Uh, see if we want, we could put many and there'd be a lot of, yeah, obviously a lot of planets per system. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and leave all that stuff alone. Uh, we'll go ahead and keep the normal speed. Oh, I had scored a victory turn. Oh, no, I didn't for that other one. Alright, no pirates. Definitely no pirates. I don't want to deal with them. Uh, yeah. So, we'll have score victory turned off. So we have to either invade each of their starting systems, build the uh, wonders, uh, have the, sci the furthest uh, thing in the applied sci sciences technology tree. Uh, what is this? I guess pretty much to buy out the galaxy and make people love you so much. Um, with the dip diplomatic victory, and the economic victory, uh, once you start getting into like where uh, you're getting a thousand or more dust per turn, you get start to get points for that. Uh, I think yeah. Then we could always uh, get that too, having three times more uh, systems than the, the other uh, than the AI. And that's fine. And I guess we can go ahead and make it timed as well. Uh, so all players will have three minutes to complete a turn before it automatically ends. That's good. Single player difficulty. Uh, let's try hard. See how that works out. And I like being the purple. So let's go ahead and start the game. Hopefully, you enjoy this, and uh, hopefully, we come out on top. And as always, if you see me doing something silly, give me a tip. Let me know. They know that I should be doing something better. <laughs> so I'm always open to advice. Alright, so we got this here tundra with mineral rich, of course. We'll go ahead and get our industry going there and set this down, set our tax down to make our people fervent, which will give us the 10% more fids on the systems. Got some. Okay, that's a good one. We're gonna definitely hire him when we can. So let's uh, take a look here. Let's see, he's good for being on our base. Uh, this guy is mixed up, so we might not take him. And we're gonna get rid of this guy. So we can have a new uh, hero coming along. And let's get our fleets moving here. Since we're not the amoebas, we don't see the entire place, so we have to run around with the seeker. Uh, let's go ahead and send that one that way. Let's send our factory over here, which is our uh, seed ship. We'll see what, uh, if anything, hopefully, we can colonize place there. 
Alright, so we'll start here, up there, and that, that, and that. Alright, so this will give us the more industry, this will give us uh, more recent, more, more uh, science, this will give us uh, more, more dust, and then we can colonize uh, tundras and arid planets. So I think that's good. All good there. And go ahead and end the turn. Now. Continue. Nothing we can do there. Darn it. Let's see. What do we have here? Oh. We can get that sort of soon. What's in Silphy? Um. That's a really nice volcano, uh, lava planet. Geothermic. See, it'll probably leave this guy here because once we can get the arid, the small arid with the antenna rings, that'd be a good dust increase. Um, that's almost done. That'll be done next turn. All right, so let's go in the turn. Leave him in Hydras, then we'll start uh, the, uh, what is it, isotope thing, Majig? Yeah, heavy isotopes. Alright, got that done. Super duper. Uh, we don't have any titanium. It's fine, though we don't need it this early. And he's going that way, and it Turn it again. Let's take a look at Wrath and see how, yeah, they were perfectly fine with the food deal. Uh, we're still producing enough that it doesn't matter. Continue fleet movement. It's not quite there. Darn. In turn, Good. okay, we can now do that. We should go right after that. Wonderful, wonderful. Aquatus. Ooh, that's a nice little place too. Hmm. Let's move in there now. Let's see. Got two. Three, four. Four turns. Move that. We should look. Can it get to here in four turns? Yeah, possibly. One, two, um, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Oh well. We'll uh, just go ahead and start a factory up there in a minute. And send it to Hydrus, so we'll get Quadus and Hydrus based roughly around the same time. I would assume. Let's take a look at this twin elliptical. So we're here, there's gonna be a bunch of stuff all over this way, a bunch in the middle, and over here still. Alright, so continue our fleet movements. That's a very strange name. We got some two gas giants, or three ja three gas giants here. This one has a volcano on it. That's interesting. Wow, that's a really good friggin' methane cloud. And this helium has ice ice on it. That's awkward. Alright, so that, then go over here. Okay. Almost done with xenobiology, or xenology. 
then we'll have the hydromel discovered and producing more uh, for us there. Okay. Dismiss. 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 Ah. Okay. That'll help the tundra. Alright, what's in Quorum? Hydrogen, hydrogen. Arctic, barren. Nothing where you can really use right now. Well, let's see. That's a lot of dust production right there. Especially with the uh, rings on them. Um, okay. In turn again. There's not very many places we can go right now, which kind of sucks. I forgot to uh, grab that hero though. We'll get him this turn. Uh, continue movement. Yeah, we can now do that. Wonderful. Hmm. Need to be able. To, I need to colonize deserts. So do I. Well, desert and Arctic. So we got these two deserts here that are really good. And there's another desert here. Yeah, so let's uh, switch this up a little bit. Where's the desert at? It's Arctic, that's desert. But we do need more science. So we need to get that soon. Uh, Alright, so we'll get that, and that, and that. That should work out. Actually, wait a minute. If we don't have enough planets, then we won't be able to put that on enough places to get that soon. So we'll hit there, and there first. Then that. that. Okay, that'll work. Should work. Nope. Then we'll grab uh, the Oostmeer. Oost yeah. Assign him to Wrath. And end our turn. So we can't leave. Alright, so we got like a little diamond ish shaped uh, constellation here. Alright, we can also get. Ooh, that's a nice tundra we can grab. Well, decent tundra. So, uh,. We'll send to Hydrus, and then we'll send to Gai... Gaikra? I don't even know. Sometimes. Alrighty. That's gonna take three turns, though. And then roughly around the same time, we'll be able to... Well, yeah, at the same time, we'll be able to uh, grab the desert that's there, too. See, there's nowhere else I can send him right now, so I might just, uh, blow it up. Because we can't go through the places. And I'll keep it there. Oh, so close. this point. Hooray! Aquatus. Let's hit it up. Bam, bam, bam. Is that? Yeah, they're all there. I always forget uh, what will help where sometimes. Okay, so then after that we'll go to Hydrus and then Gaikra. Maybe... Can't go there yet. There, we're not going to be able to get those for a long while. But then I'll send to the desert, probably. Yeah, we'll send up to Selfie after Hydrus, or maybe Selfie before Hydrus. 
be able to do selfie before high just because of that uh, six industry on uh, selfie six. Okay, I'll let that sort it out. In turn, it's into selfie. This create go on to Sophie. Alrighty. So this will take a while as it always does to start out with, but once we get it, we'll go real quick. Let's go ahead and colonize this here desert, and then pop out another factory after that. And end their turn. Early game is always quick in turns, but uh, yeah. Hero leveled up, wonderful. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and hit the director first, because this uh, 25 extra industry on the star system really helps out in early game. Helps out so much, it's not even. It's just ridiculous, really. Alright, let's see, how's our money situation? It's alright. In turn. What just happened here? Huh? Oh, right. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw another industrial zones on that place. Alright. Hmm, they're not happy. But that's fine. 